shoot off for gold. Hermosillo was pretty special. It was in Mexico. I feel like that's the place where they have the craziest fans and craziest spectators. It does look like Fullerton has done this. My first World Cup win. The 20 year old Dane, who's promised so much over the last few seasons. He's been waiting for this breakthrough moment throughout his career. He is the 2023 Hyundai Archery World Cup champion. It's semi-final time of the 2021 Hyundai Archery World Cup. Little bit of a shake there in a 29. Fullerton again in the bronze medal match. He's 19, he's the youngest archer here, but he just doesn't seem to take it that last step. Yet. Yet. <laughs> Something in me was like, it was just the right moment. I had shot really good and lost a lot of times, so I think I wasn't really afraid of losing anymore. I felt like my shooting was good back then, uh, but I felt like no luck had really been on my side, so it was kind of a weird feeling. I didn't really feel like I could be able to win, but I knew in the back of my head that if I just shot good, I would have the chance, and I shot good. And you know, I had Braden Galantine behind me, uh, which I had looked up for many years, and is now a good friend, so. I think he helped me calm me a little bit down too, and it was just everything clicked that, that day. Definitely was something special with having him behind me as a coach. Mostly I've had Damsbo behind me, and you know, Braden shot for the USA team, so it was kind of, it was a little bit different than what I was used to, which maybe was a good thing. Of course, I wasn't too much focused on what the coach said, but just on what I shot. But it just makes it a lot better to win with him behind me because he knows what it feels like and you could like share the happiness with the coach behind you, which is really nice. Next season, I see myself shooting even better. Also see myself shooting in the finals a lot more and being a little more dominant on the podium.